So no Lyle's girlfriend blocks me. Why she blocks me? I'm not sure. Never say anything bad about me. I mean, I'm a, you know, say what's right and what's wrong. Give my opinion on certain topics and just state facts at the end of the day. Now, often we don't like the way facts sound and we don't like the way the truth sounds because the truth often isn't pretty. But I'm not going to get on here and lie to make someone feel better about themselves. If I feel like you clout chasing, I just feel like you clout chasing. And more than likely, you are. And that's just the case. But I, she's been having me blocked for a long ass time for some reason. I don't know why. I tried to go to her Instagram and this was like what I saw type shit. She has me blocked on TikTok. And all I ever really say is that she's not fast. If she comes to the United States, she would never make a team. She probably wouldn't even be amongst the top five high schoolers in the United States. Not even probably, she wouldn't be. And she has no identity. She's known as Noah Lyle's girlfriend. Did I lie on any of those statements? No. Like if you just Google her name, it's always Noah Lyle's girlfriend, and then they include her name. Olympic champion's girlfriend, Junelle. Noah Lyle's girlfriend, Janelle Broomfield. Her whole identity is being with Noah Lyle's. She has no identity. And anybody saying I'm hating or being negative, you're plain stupid. I'm just stating the obvious. And if stating facts is what got me blocked, she's ridiculous. Because you got to think about it. You're a public figure. Well, at least you're dating a public figure. So that be, by default, makes you a public figure. And you caring about what people say online? Everybody want to be famous. Everybody want to be big until it's time to be famous. And it's time to deal with famous people deal with. Now, all of a sudden, I'm blocked. <laughs> what the fuck? What's going on, beautiful peeps? Now, it is a boy, John Fee. Now, I know a lot of people are saying that, you know, this topic should die down and put to rest. But I'm not going to lie, my beautiful people. This was really interesting. And I really just had to share it. Now, I made a previous video on, you know, Erin Brown critiquing or talking about Janelle Broomfield and it was pretty interesting now as I said a lot of people are saying that you know the situation does should put down but I saw this video and I just really had to share it with you guys now by no means am I instigating anything you know I'm just really really bringing this to light now as y'all heard in the clip Aaron Brown shared the fact that Janelle Broomfield blocked him and he feels as if you know because of the things he has said now I want to make it pretty clear that a lot of things that Aaron Brown said you know a lot of things you know might see him very very disrespectful by some people while some people might feel as if you know he's pretty much stating the fact now from my perspective um i do believe most of it is the fact because i've seen it myself you know a lot of times when people are referring to janelle broomfield you know they refer to her as Noah's girlfriend i don't know much about the american track you know business but from the times i've seen i don't think janelle broomfield will be you know fully able to run for USC and all of that now I made it pretty clear from day one that I don't believe she's seeking attention because Janelle Broomfield could have done a lot more interviews and she did not and even for the Simpsons session it was Simone Powell who reached out to Janelle Broomfield to do the interview so as I made it pretty clear I don't believe Janelle Broomfield is seeking attention and it's just something that come when you're famous and you you know you're a celebrity because at the end of the day she's Noah Lai's girlfriend and Noah Lai's is some sort of well not sort of he is a celebrity you know and we have to speak the fact we can't answer the truth and turn a blind eye to it now as i said and i'm going to repeat i know i said this situation should just move on but i just really had to share this video now i promise this is going to be the last time i'm speaking on Junel broomfield situation relating to this matter all the online scandal and anything you know anything relating to that this is the last time my beautiful people it must be something that i really really need to bring to y'all for me to come up back with this topic so this will be the last time on it but once again i want to say big up no allies big up Junel broomfield feel big up jumpy my beautiful peeps remember to drop a like and subscribe as it helps out a lot and it'll be greatly appreciated but thank you for your time and thank you for watching it is a boy jumpy and i'm out